Good morning. Uh, I'm out here amongst the bean fields and storm clouds this morning. Um, I'm loaded up, headed south to the farm, but I wanted to stop. This is the first of one of the uh, just kind of random places that I found just using satellite imagery. definitely tell you could see this could definitely be uh, a place that might have water flow problems looks good right now though it's not very high it's flowing They're actually pumping out of it down there uh, usually something like that if they're pumping water out of it it's gonna be maintained pretty good um, you can tell here, see all this on the ground? Uh, somebody's been keeping that cleaned out. Uh, see how clear the water is? That's well water. It just comes out very clear like that, even after it's run off a field. Still very clear. Um, but that's flowing pretty good right now, but definitely might be a spot to watch in the winter. And they're not pumping out of it might not be as maintained as well. If you haven't figured it out yet, I'm a sucker for abandoned buildings. This one's a little bit newer one. I really like old buildings, but nothing has been abandoned. It's usually of some interest. I'd say this one was a jackpot. Um, it's kind of interesting though. It's, it's almost like there's kind of some intentional damming right there going on. You got these rocks built up here, kind of acting like a spillway. So they're trying to hold some water back in there. But you definitely have that beaver activity along the top there. Got it up higher. Huh. It's interesting. Let's go look at the other side. Got some water coming in from this ditch right here. The ditch on the other side is really backed up, and I wonder if that's probably why. like it's kind of going around the side of it there. Uh, I don't know what's up with the wire there. What is that? It looks like some kind of, I don't know if that's a coax cable or what, but um, this is a good site right here. All right. So my main goal today get this gas tank changed out on this tractor. This one is horribly rusty and uh, it keeps clogging up the line and stuff in here. Can't hardly do anything on it. Unclog it and it clogs right back up. So got this other tank, parts tractor. Um, it's not perfect, but I did electrolysis on it. Um, cleaned out a ton of the crud inside there so it should be a lot better uh, we'll see I'm gonna get it swapped out we'll see what happens here's a look at one of the common locations you're used to seeing 
don't really see any activities of beavers since the last time I was here. Um, damn. But, we got a, there's a trap in there. One of the jaw type uh, traps. And some things that were stuck in there to try and force them to go a certain way. So I think this little test run of trying out a couple locations I found in satellite imagery and checking them for beaver locations worked out pretty good. Um, batting 500. Now I'll go back and I'm going to research what's downstream from this uh, beaver dam. I want to make sure that I know what the impact is downstream from opening that up. Thing looks good. You should see this new location probably in my next video. So we'll see you then. Thanks for watching.